tell us, like, you know, tell us obviously, like, where you're from, man, how you got your start. I'm from Chicago, Illinois. How I got started when I was 11 years old. My cousin introduced me to the FL studio, and ever since then, I've just been learning. Like, let us in. Just let us in. Just give us one chance. Like, man, we're just going to do it. So that's that's basically what it is. The whole little movement about the Chicago movement. So far as keep the star act, the pushing. And me and him, you know, we had the bond. So we just made it. Just, just pushing it. Just pushing it hard so everybody can get in. I hooked up with Chief Keef back in 2010. He had a mixtape called Bang, because he had a single called Bang at the time. So I was on that mixtape, I had one joint on them. He got locked up. And then he got back, he got out. He hit me on Facebook. And like, Chop Man, bring the studio. Bring the studio. I think this was around. this year, 2012. I made the beat and made the song the same day. That's how it was. I got out of school. I went to his crib, and we did the whole song, the beat, everything right there. That's how we did it. To be honest, the song wasn't titled till after the song was recorded. And then he was like, "Nah, we gonna name it 300. Hana with the H U N N A." So I was like, "Okay, cool. That sound cool." Three Hunter is they little area. It's like Lamron. You know, the, the street pole, you know, it got 300 up there, the 64th block, 300 up there, you know. So that's how that came about. Like, actually, I ain't even had this beat in my head. I just did it at the moment. It was just moment spot, like, okay, we just gonna make a beat. That's how I do it. Actually, I started off with a, um, a Nexus Brass. So it was like real crazy, and I liked it there. So I was like, okay, cool. And at the time, I didn't have no keyboard, the USB keyboard. So I just played it on here. And it, it, it just came out right. 808, you know, the 808s. And there they go. And that's how that was. Just a simple little hi hat. And then I added a scream and a gunshot. So this this is my signature too. Like when you hear a scream and a gunshot on top of each other, as me, it's like this. Yeah. So that that's basically how that is. And then I added a bell. Like the beat was finished, but I needed something to to fill it out. And this bell was it. So, yeah. How, how many hours do you think that took to do all that? About like 15 to 20 minutes. It was quick. We sent the song to the DJs. We put out a, um, a preview. Shout out to DJ Hustlenomics. He put the song out. And after it, like the first day, it hit 20,000 off that one song. And then a couple of weeks later, like one week later, he did the video. And then. It just blew up. Young chop on the beat. Bandcamp.
the 300 record is good, but we had a song that came after that that don't like. It, it reached Kanye West's attention. A fart nigga, that's that shit I don't like. Nah. A snitch nigga, that's that shit I don't like. Nah. Don't like, like.